How many times have you watched an art fundamentals tutorial huh? and then you open up your drawing app and you don't know what the fuck you need to do? So you just open up TikTok. <laughs> Fucking TikTok! Your attention is fucked. You can't even, you perhaps can't even watch this video without quitting literally one second after hearing my voice. Oh, I need to learn fundamentals. Bro, chances are you already know the fundamentals. Don't fucking lie. How many tutorials have you watched? If you don't know it already, fine. Go watch Marco Pucci's videos. It's free. Fucking hell, this motorcycle, bro. It's free. Go watch Marco Pucci's video. It's free. It's amazing. And you got all the knowledge you need. But when you're already watched fundamentals video and you're trying to learn it, you're not actually learning it. Huh? Why? Because you're seeing it as a chore. You know, you're seeing learning fundamentals as some kind of unpleasant task that you need to fulfill. Although it kind of is. Oh fuck, uh, I need to learn anatomy, value, or color theory, bro. I went from this kind of anatomy to this. And it's because I don't see it as a chore that I need to learn to get good at. No, it's because I want to draw Yae Miko in a fucking sexy pose that looks pleasing to my eyes. Huh? And because of how I approach it, how I approach it causes me to learn more about anatomy because I need to make Yae Miko look sexy. Do you understand? You see, when I was drawing this, never in my mind that I have, have I thought that I was trying to learn anatomy. No, I was just trying to draw this sexy pose, more sexy. But Ras, is there even a difference, you stupid? <clears throat> there is. Otherwise, there won't be this video, duh. How you approach stuff, how you approach stuff will be the difference between learning kinda good and learning immense. <clears throat> Instead of trying to learn value by doing photo study of a fucking apple, bro. Fucking apple. Go draw your crush. Draw your significant other. If you're single, then tough luck. Wait, I'm single, bro. Uh, whatever. Draw your favorite characters in black and white. Trust me, bro. It makes all the difference in the world. Oh, you don't believe me? Fuck you. But I have proof. First proof is for my followers. Nietzsche.stnk. Shout out to him. Or her, I don't know. Look. The key word is drawing something that interests you. What's the point in growing apples? Fucking apples! I hate apples, bro. Fucking balls of grayscale of death. Skull emoji, skull emoji. Shout out to shitnichi.instagram for being a G. Trust me, bro. Drawing something that interests you will make you learn more about fundamentals than trying to learn. Mindset matters, bro. And I feel like you haven't truly understand how important it is. I saw an interview of Kim Jong Gi. An amazing artist that are able to draw perspective, anatomy, and form amazingly. Rest in peace, Kim Jong Gi. But the point I saw in an interview that he didn't learn about perspective fundamentals such as two two point perspective, vanishing point. He doesn't know about all of that. Of course, he then learned about it. But before he knows about it, he was already making art in perspective. It's so fucking crazy, bro. What the hell? Now. You could argue that he is talented, that he is able to do all of this shit. Which, I agree, he is talented, but you're already labeling yourself as not talented. You know, oh, he's talented, I'm not talented, that's why it's going to be harder for me to achieve what he does. Well, what the fuck? You're literally at your baby face. Huh? You're literally at still at the earliest stage of growth, of, of improvement. And then you're making yourself at a disadvantage by giving labels to yourself. Hello? Stop giving yourself a disadvantage, bro. Me personally, I don't want to self-deprecate myself huh? in a way that causes harm to me. If I self-deprecate myself and you laugh, that's that's a value I hear. That's a value that I uh emit to the whole world. But if you're self-deprecating yourself and the result is just you not being able to achieve your dream. <laughs> <laughs> no. <clears throat> I will only believe in ideology or a fucking faith in something 
that gives power to me. I will never believe on things that take power away from me. So if labeling yourself as not talented is harming you, why the fuck are you believing it, bro? You know what? Whatever. Hope you learned something. Bye. Check out my Instagram. Bye.